So here we are then, uh, Thursday morning, quarter past 11. I guess this is probably one of the most important track walks of the season as you've never raced here before. Yeah, I mean, getting out on a circuit for the first time is important. I mean, most of them we, we might take a car around or, or walk around or take a scooter around, but here it's important to, to go on a tuk-tuk, I feel. Only 16,000 kilometres this one. Yeah, this is new. This that is, surprises me. Do you know me. how this is? It's only a year old. Are you kidding? No, honestly, this is a year old. Oh, wow. We've got you a nice new one, but the worrying thing is it goes up to 80 kilometres an hour. Really? Right We're then. off. Oh, yeah. Wow, how smooth was that? Where's the uh, curse button? <laughs> All right. You're not a real tuk-tuk driver, too. You use the horn a lot. I of know. Time. I just got to try and get this thing in neutral. There you go. There you go, perfect. Well done. I think that deserves a round of applause, actually. Thank you very much. It's not only a Formula One car that the boy can drive, is it? That is an amazing bit of kit. It's great. I think we could maybe learn a few things from this uh, for next year, what do you reckon? Now, you guys are already having a good look at this uh, larger lump here. Just what? tell us what's going through your head, Jakob, when you take a look at that. Well, it really is, did we get it right in the simulator? Yeah. So we come and check it out and make sure that uh, the work that we did to prepare for this event was, uh, was correct. I think um, looking at the curbs, I think we're, uh, we're okay. Yeah. It doesn't look as tight in reality as it did in the sim. Yeah, I think it's, looked, I think it's this, more open. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Which is nice. Nicely decorated, don't you think? I do. I do think it's lovely. So when you're walking here as well and you can see grandstands and you can see you know, things such as port and yeah. marshal posts, so they, are, you, are you logging those in your yeah. brain as well? What? The Portaloo for distance more than where am I going to get a toilet if the car breaks? Yeah, down. of yeah, course. Obviously. But it's always important. Or I go off. Yeah. Um, but yeah, the little things that are, are bright that you can pick out are important, mostly for entry, because when you're doing 320, 330k down here, it's very difficult to find a brake marker yeah. if they don't put brake markers, so you've got to look for something else. Doesn't that look great though? It does look amazing, doesn't it? I mean, if that, that was, looks if that was dead flat, it wouldn't be as exciting. No, not at all. Teamwork, huh? It's good, mate, I like it. Was a success. And we're away. Can you grass it? Yeah. <laughs> it could have killed me. Jonathan's idea to steal it. <laughs> well, would you just grab the map, gents, and just explain to us quickly sort of where we've been, what, what we've learned on our journey that you didn't know before you came here? Um, well, turn, turn one's a lot more open than we thought on the sim. Turn three on the entry is a lot more open, but tighter on the exit. The same through four. Um, this section is all very similar to what we had in the sim, which is great because we've done a lot of laps. Um, this corner is gravel at the apex, which is very, very strange. But the great thing about the circuit is, which is very different to a lot of the new tracks, from turn five through to turn 15, it's all pretty fast um, with good change of direction. So it's going to be a lot of fun out there. One, two, three. Go on, wheel spin, wheel spin, wheel spin. I try. Yeah, yeah. Go on. Oh. <laughs> you know, the most important thing today that I've learned is that the tuk tuk drivers in uh, India are very skilled. Yeah. You thought you were the best 24 drivers yeah. in the world. Wrong. Get out there, mate. Get out yeah. there in New Delhi. These things rock. Yeah, talk As in rock. Things, <laughs> Tom, would you just let us know how much is on the meter? Because one of you's got to foot the bill for this. Yeah. Uh, what was that? Uh, 240 rupees. 240 rupees, because this has come all the way from Delhi. Four pounds. Is that about four pounds? Right, well, there's only one man here who's just signed a nice, juicy new contract, so we'll... Uh, Who's that? We'll have four quid for you. <laughs> come on, Yakov. 